All right, hello everyone. Hope you all are doing well. We are trying out some Paper Mario Randomizer today. We finished up our Paper Mario replay last week, and again, the goal with that was to try out Randomizer, because I've seen some lovely, talented people playing Paper Randomizer, and it just always seemed like a ton of fun. We've had fun with SMRPG Randomizer, so let's try out some Paper Randomizer, shall we? You'll see the layout is a little bit different this time because we have a different tracker over here. Uh, one that is, as it's called, a paint tracker made by Mukomo. Uh, it includes a lot of logic. It's like if you get the spoiler log text file and you put it in here, it generates all these numbers as to where stuff is. It also has tracking for partners, your items, keys, minor stuff, and badges and things. Because all of these all count for logic and such. We're just going to be giving this a go. Oh man. Let's see. Let me see if I can go into what we have set up. I did use a uh, settings string generated by uh, Supreme and Spike Vegeta, I believe, since they were both very helpful to the community and especially to the tracker and such. And this was one of the setting strings that they came up with. So uh, we are going to have shuffled items, which, I mean, it's a shuffler, it's a randomizer. Uh, we also are going to have key sanity, which I believe means that you can get keys for any dungeon anywhere. Uh, gear shuffle, such as your boots and your hammers, are full shuffle, which means they can be anywhere that's not inside their typical places. Uh, Koopa Coop favors are vanilla, letter delivery rewards are vanilla. Uh, Rip Cheeto items in Logic, the guy in the bottom of the blue house. There are six items we could purchase from him that would be in Logic. So there's that. Uh, this also adds item pouches. I believe it is five. So instead of having the typical ten item spots, you have fifteen, or you can have up to fifteen. Uh, Shop Sanity, I believe, means you can have any item in Logic or any item anywhere. Uh, Rolf items in logic, that means the uh, father and son bad shop duo in town, can uh, have stuff other than badges, including partners, as well as uh, Merlot items. Merlot is the kid that sells you badges up in uh, Merlee's house. He can also sell important stuff. You can also shuffle partners, it means we're going to get a random partner at the start and you're not going to find the partners in order. So. Uh, we are starting with a minimum and a maximum of one partner. We're starting with random. Uh, badges. Badges. BP costs, FP usage costs, partners FP, and star power all are fully randomized, which is going to be interesting. History is vanilla, whatever that means. Uh, something else. Oh no, I forgot to change that. What? Oh well, that's fine. Um... I know one of the fun things, especially with like randomizers, is uh, the cosmetics. So I was hoping to make it randomized on every load as I've seen done, which is really cute. But uh, for some odd reason, both Paracarry and Watt were set to default in blue somehow, even though I was trying to put random on every load. But either way, everything else will be uh, random cosmetics on every load for every other partner, bosses, and enemies are a random pick. Coin color is going to be purple. Status menu will be teal. Interesting. And then, of course, enemy difficulty is going to be shuffled. We are going to have a few item traps in there. I didn't want to deviate any from uh, what Supreme and Spike had done before. So, uh, just because there is an item may not mean that it's real. So, that's going to be interesting. Um, it is also, we can beat the seed, uh, the number part of Star Spirits is going to be four, again, it's their setting string, which makes sense. We are also having, uh, required specific spirits on, uh, limit chapter logic. Again, all this I'm going to be learning. 
right now it just says it's true and false. It doesn't have like what the details are on the previous page. And it looks like Mario's starting stats starts with 15 HP, 20 FP, 18 BP, no star power, regular boots and hammer, 150 coins, and we'll start in Toad Town. The other things are um, a couple of different places. Uh, Prologue will not be open. Mount Rugged will be open, as well as Forever Forest. Toy Box and Whale will be closed. Means you just have to do what you have to do to open those up, story-wise. Blue House is open, which is nice. You don't have to get the key or do shenanigans to get in there. As well as, uh, Chapter 7 Bridge Visible. Hmm. Forget what that is. And then, uh, Bowser's Castle is just going to be... The boss rush. A couple other settings are you always have on I Spy, which tells you where star pieces could be. You always have on Peekaboo, which means you'll see enemy HP uh, speedy spin because gotta go fast and you don't have to spend BP on that. Um, another cool thing is there are item hints, such as like grass or trees or something. That would be like a little sparkle or something if there's an item in there you just go over and grab it hidden blocks are always visible and cutscenes are shortened we skip epilogue we skip the quizzes we can just get a, a star piece i believe from chuck quizmo if we find visible hidden panels or lovely hints and spoiler alert. so all that to say if any of that makes sense because again i'm still learning this myself but yeah, that is how we are going to be playing the pip and whatnot today. Alright. Uh, still learning how to do ape tracker. Like things where to put. Because if it says if we start with regular boots, boots and hammer, I don't know if I need to place those anywhere. Because the thing about this is, and you'll see the numbers and stuff, is that each each of these things has a certain value and then it's adjusted as such and I believe it's that uh partners partners have nine I might have to pull that up Hang on. there's a read me here somewhere again this is all learning stuff this is all the learning stuff okay here it is uh the values for all the items. A partner and or hammer boots upgrade is worth 9 points. A chapter require item plus the ultra stone are worth 7 points. Other key items that aren't required for chapter cleaning, clearing, but can give checks are worth 5 points. Uh, items, uh, all the items below are 3 points, such as the uh, item pouch, FP, HP+, plus, power plus, spike shield, feeling fine. Dodge Master, Mega Quake, Mega Smash, Mega Jump, Bump Attack. Okay. And then, of course, all the numbers that are blue uh, mean uh, regions with uh, no checks. No valuable checks, I believe. But yeah. Yeah, all that stuff. Before we forget, Savvy told me that the in-game map has been enhanced. So if you ever really get stuck, you can check the map. It'll tell you how many checks you have left in an area. I did read that somewhere. I can't remember if that was in Mukomo's thing or if that was on the Pape Randomizer website. But yeah, I do remember reading that somewhere where it's like if you hit start, and we'll check that out in a minute, um, it'll show you checks and all kinds of cool things. But thank you. I do appreciate that. And I do know Savvy has also been pretty involved with the paper randomizer as well which for all of you if you do want to try out paper mario randomizer you can always hit enter the command exclamation mark pmr and it will take you to the website get you set up kind of similar to smrpg rando but anyway long story short let me get live split up yeah i should have splits on here do promise we'll get going it's like again we're starting a new new venture we gotta kind of have the details of it for all of you at home mm -hmm. 
It's interesting. It's I understand why they don't show some stuff. Like, you know, not the cutscene that's typical and stuff. When uh, you have the uh, main menu screen going. But they still play the story of uh, telling you a tale about the star spirits and such, as well as uh, seeing Bowser and Kami Koopa. And it's interesting, Kami was actually a different color. So we'll see that on down the line. Old please. Be good. Oh, you got. Oh gosh, your game just opened up. Let's go. <sighs> Again, I don't know how this seed is gonna treat me, or logic, or lack of good sleep, or anything. But we're gonna find out. So, with all that being said, and all those settings and everything, and if you're curious about the settings, um, you can still also do the command exclamation mark settings, and then it'll show you the seed and all that stuff. So. Start. Alright. We'll just go with the typical. It should start and we'll get going in three, two, one, go. Oh my. Oh, we start with uh. Oh my gosh, why is it stuttering? going on crap well oh hold on folks great starting partner it is why why is it stuttering like this that's concerning I didn't get a chance to really test this and I was trying to go in as blind as possible yes I am medley and it made sure to do the thing they asked you to do. Sometimes I notice that my inputs are being weird too. This is gonna make for this is gonna make for a slow seed if I can't figure out what's going on. I'm also not sure what to do when you start with stuff, because I feel like that would alter the uh that would alter the um the logic. Like what do I where I guess where do I put like hammer and your boots and your starting partner? You just like Take them out. Ugh. Growing pains. Let's see. Hey, hold on, folks. Thank you. 
Damn, it's so fast. Maybe get some help. Rando Discord. Sure. Seems like hmm. I think it changed my Yeah, I think it somehow reset my conf this. I think we're good. Hopefully. Cross your fingers. Go ahead. We'll reset. Hopefully things should... just going to act like none of that happened. <laughs> yeah, restarting this in three, two, one. Good. Oh. 
Still, still unsure where I should put. Since I started with uh, what's his face, Lack of Lester. But we'll see. You damn jump badge? I don't think that's included. Gotta find the boots and or the hammer in order to be able to find any of these panels. Free sparkle. Oh no, how do I open prologue? Huh. And of course, anybody that has tips or tricks or suggestions, y'all can kind of feel free to chime in here. Because this is very, very new to me. Yeah, I am not sure how to open prologue. Aside, I guess, from going through the sewer? I guess that's a thing. Master Power Plus. Ooh. Ooh, that's tempting. Okay, so we know Plus is in Toad Town. It's a Power Plus. I am just count. Lemon. I don't think we have anything back home. I think home is included in the for uh, chapter three. Oh yeah, uh, I can't do the ground pound because I don't have shoes. What you got? Oh, it's the artifact. Interesting. For you, uh, yeah. this chain? Okay, flower fields is open. I guess we should go ahead and head to Shooting Star Summit.
I see. So, that means... That chapter 1... Crap, now I've got to remember order. I know this is Shy Guy's toy box. But one, two, three, four? Okay, right down here. One, two, yeah, one, two, three, four. That's a number on my luggage. Very interesting for just having sequential required chapters. <gasps> Bombay! Let's go. Ah. Oh, rude. Rude. <laughs> well, there's our first trap, people. So he has spike shoe. Hidden pouch. It's interesting, a star piece for five star pieces. No thanks. Still says he has four though. Wait, so what do you mean? Hey, Special K, how are you? Uh, I did the setting string according to what a Supreme had shared when I first asked about a uh, rando. Um, if you're curious, if you understand it, um, I do have the settings link in the settings command. If you want to check that out. Hmm. Oh, maybe the rewards are for gathering so many star pizzas. Again, I'm still learning this. Might have to like look into a video someone somewhere in the future. Figure out exactly how to interpret this. Mega jump? This is... So this is the yellow berry. Okay, yeah, but next bonus for you. Oh, 
and I guess that's how the panels look. Where uh, star pieces might be hiding. Got it. Well, that is handy. There's a pipe there. Interesting. Let's then save. Figure out where we can go. Still a lot of stuff here in Toad Town. Do you have anything? Oh, thank you. I mean, I'll take one. You got little blinks, rugged. seeing like what free checks there are around here let me actually go back and save and maybe we can check with uh rip cheeto see what items he has Ooh, now i guess the question is does rip cheeto count as the sewer Hmm. History. I'm assuming this is the sewers. Okay, and it's the first six item. Has the scarf. Fortress key. What? Okay. And the pyramid stone. Wow. Which again, if we have to clear chapters one, two, three, and four, those are necessary. Uh. can't be real, can it? Hmm. Hmm. Nope, she's real. Good. Interesting. Good town. Hmm. Oh. 
But this does mean we could go do chapter four. Hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Nuts. Is there a way to stay block in here? Mm -hmm. I mean, I'll take it. And if there's things I didn't remember about this game, I'm definitely gonna have to learn. Or to get good. Yeah. We do. Dig that. Oh, and I'm guessing shops means like the items that you bought. You know what? Let's actually see if we can get through the sewers, back to, back to, uh, what's it, the Goomba Village. So I love that color, a bow. Very pretty. I'm a sucker for blue. Fur, boots. Yeah, I see you up there. Ooh! Pretty lucky included. Oh, this one! This one was uh, in the toad shop, though. I do like pretty lucky, though. Wow, that's a lot of badge points. Add on. Great, you'll know what time it is. Blooper! Shadows disappearing. <laughs> Ooh, out of sight is expensive.
is, is gonna be close. Rude. Stop that. Close, but we should have them. <laughs> Pretty lucky. Already paying off. That's a lot of experience. Alright, what we got? What? Holy heck, we can beat chapter four. Super. Dang. Okay, I see you, game. Yeah, shoot, we can go, we can go check Toy Box. And there is quite a bit in Toy Box, according to our tape tracker over there. Um, uh, first, Mario needs it. Number of checks here in Toad Town. Fifteen of them. I'm guessing some of those are going to be uh, annals. Not just going to be star pieces under the This castle has none. We check shooting star. Just because, let's actually go explore Shy Guy's toy box since we've got Bo and Watt. checks though because we don't have the train yet
Oh gosh. Oh, y'all are big. What chapter uh, difficulty are you guys at? What the crap? Oh, dang it. Whack-a-bomb. Wow. Wow. A letter and a lucky heart. Coconut. Our keeper. Nothing that's necessary. The only thing that would be a concern is a letter. That way we could get paracarry. Mm. Oops. Ooh, boy, or Might need to go. Crap. Hmm. Great. Rude. Take advantage of that toad house. So there's at least possibly one letter in here, maybe two. Let's see. Away. Yep. to learn at some point to tell the difficulty because the difficulty changes per chapters pretty sure I'm not sure how to tell that just yet it's 
do. This. There was a fake item back there? That's rude. Just a mushroom anyway. Eh. Dang it. Castle key. That's chapter three. Mm. There we go. Ooh, that's actually kind of nice. Badges we're using stuff for right now, so. Think of what we could do next. So I do believe when we go left to go to Koopa Brothers Fortress and Koopa Village, that I can't see Koopa is going to be there waiting for us. And we don't have anything to put him to sleep. Plus, it's a matter of paying him a hundred coins, fortunately. Oh, well, which I guess we have, it just stinks, the but mm. have to do what we gotta do. Alright, it does look like an ad is starting though, so I'm just gonna be wandering around. I, I might go ahead and just take a break just so stand up and stretch and all that so i encourage you all to do the same we always run three minutes to turn off pre-rolls you'll know how it is if you want to not see ads you'll know what to do and we will be right back
Alright, that should be wrapping up. So thank you all for your patience. Hmm. I have to think about where we can go now. Not really much else we can go without more partners, and, uh, other items, and such. So let's let's try going to flower fields real quick. Even though it's not required, it could still have. It has 13 points there. Even though we were playing, it's remembering uh, what we have access to. But again, kind of like SMRPG. We will learn with time. Oh, go away. We will learn with time. Uh, what we can and can't do. Oop. Dizzy dial. That's fake? So we've already got the real record. How hard are y'all? Oh dear. This is dropping the blueberry down, which we don't do. What the? Well, that's special. Money, money, and star points. Oops. All right, note to self forget hitting the trees. 
I mean, heck, I think that was even the hard lesson in the Noah. was like, stop hitting the trees unless you want to encounter bazaps. Oh, we do... You have like a Lester. Oh. Right. We have like a Lester, but we don't have the boots. What to do the jump with? Let's see. Theory. Blueberry. Blueberry. Alright. Not much we can do in here. I guess let's go see if we can do checks out here. Hey, can't see Koopa has done money. Oh, I thought it was a hundred. Or is it fifty on the way back? Gosh, what the heck? Why do these guys have so much HP? Again, pretty lucky. Pretty good find in the beginning of this. That's a lot of star points, holy heck. Me thinks chapter one is going to be much higher difficulty. FP plus? Which I'm guessing this counts as a uh, Koopa, Koopa Village. Frying pan? 
Take the reset. Thank you Cooper Shell. Okay. Wait, is that not there? It is. Take that. That is very convenient, it is. Right back? What you got, Medley? Hey. Sure, take that. Ended up rolling the paper equivalent and open Ganon's castle. Hard star spirit set to negative one. What? Ow. <laughs> That's crazy. Them darn fuzzies. get anything for helping all the Koopas. Watch your overalls. Yeah, you all. I do appreciate that they have the sparkles. Oh, let's check the Toad House. Check the shop. Deep star point. Eh. There you are, citizen. Smash charge. Huh. That's not required, so... Blueberry. Again, I don't think you get anything for helping them, it's just something to do. Oh, 
Great. Hey, Cooper! Come on. I mean, I got your shell, but I know what we gotta do. Hmm. This one? Not required, so... We'll still go get it. I think that is a check. Oh, hi. Ooh, boy. Hmm. Hey, I'll take it. Swap over the bow. Ooh. All right. Anybody wants to guess the number of trees that the fuzzies are going to be in? Drop your numbers real quick. Nuts. I was thinking 231 as well, Medley, but. Rip. Stuff. 
We've actually gotten pretty good luck with drop items. I have to say. Yeah, I do not know what chapter this is, but I just know we are getting a lot of experience for some higher up enemies for sure. This should also afford us a level up, which is nice. Holy heck, 10 star points per fuzzy? That's nuts. Uh, yeah. Considering chapter 1 seems to be higher difficulty than chapter 1. Sad I can't get that. I need Cooper. Here you go. hoping for, but... Hmm. What's that? First attack. It's not bad, is it? Thank you. Do I have four? I haven't ever done well, not this playthrough or my previous playthrough, like the Koopa Coop favors. I think the, the Koopa Koop favors are vanilla. I don't think it means that there's gonna be logic items in it. I don't know. So we got two of the blueberries, so I could actually go back and do that check in uh, flower fields. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, Very handy. Two more checks here, though. There were five checks on Pleasant Path. Thank you. 
to say, I am... I am not sure where those checks are. Oh, I do have... Is it the... Tips. Tip screen is handy. Well, I'm guessing the checks they mean are the panels that are here. Assuming. Hmm. Yeah, let's actually go back to flower fields. So can we see how wonderful uh, Homeward Shroom is? It'd be really nice if, uh, what's it, uh, if some RPG randomizer had something similar to that. Not that it'd be required, but it's a nice touch. Yeah, now we got a couple of checks we can do over here. Helping you today. Go get this to you. Hmm, sure. It saved us in a pinch before. Trying to get it where it's the sequence of one, two, three, four moles instead of like going all the way to four. Ah, 
I had you. Give me the game. Well, whatever. This is three moles. Call it with your seed, that was a bit too much, all. Eh, GG's. Seed one because of chapter seven. Oh no. Pretty lucky. <laughs> the second seed in a row where Pierre Carey was stuck in Crystal Palace. Has this one been? It's been interesting. Uh, we found a fake bombette underneath Shooting Star Summit. We've gotten Bo and Watt. But technically, I need to just find the items in order to finish the toy box. Yeah, just so far it's just getting used to where to check stuff. Come on, nerds. There we go. I mean, so far we found some decent items, but yeah, I guess I haven't been to Cooper Brothers Fortress yet. I should have done that. Uh, Medley, do you use do you use the Pape Logic Tracker, or do you just use a regular item tracker? I'm curious.
Uh, this again. And we'll have the moles done, and I guess we'll see what kind of reward Petunia gives us. so much in Toad Town too, but I'm not sure. Again, I've just got to learn where all the checks are. Thanks. Pretty lucky. Oh, I don't think I have what it takes to take these guys out, so run away! Uh, if I do this, then I'm gonna have to fight the Lakitu's. Here vaguely worth it. Oh, wow. I have what? Try that. Hope we don't die. Hmm. 
<laughs> Pretty lucky. History. Ah, Rude. Well, that's some garbage. I'm a die. Yep. Mm, okay, well, there's one thing over there we can check, but... There's not too much of value here in flower fields, really. I mean, it was worth double checking. Oh. <sighs> There's still a number of things here in Toad Town, but I'm unsure where to find them. Back when you get more XP, yeah. get Harry yet. Is Vuko in the forest? Oh, the placement of the extra save points, that's nice. I was like, Boodler, I'm right here! Shouldn't be too bad. Hopefully. Again, I don't know what difficulty chapter one is gonna be.
Wait, did that fuzzy not give me any experience? What the crap? Did you start at level 10? I think so. I think that was the string setting that Supreme had. I don't know. If I'm not getting any experience, I'm out of here. Some enemies are just weak enough as to not to provide it. Ah. So you can switch off dropping XP. Oh. It said something about like a badge or runaway pay. Yeah, I'll have to look into that setting next time.
All right, Boo's Mansion has 20, and we are going to have to beat this chapter at some point. Nice dialogue game. So we can't do this. Oh, how neat. They even did it in the colors. That's classic. Nice touch, devs. Oh, I do have the record. Super Smash Charge. Welp. Okay, then this is the guessing game. Another badge. down pound okay hmm. there's eight checks here my gosh Five checks in Forever Forest? Uh. Okay, I obviously don't know where all the checks are, unfortunately. I feel like that's gonna be not great news for me. Can I go through if I have bow? Boo! <laughs> you don't have to worry about it, it's a zero on the tracker. Well, yeah, that is true. 
No, I still need the items to get through the rest of the mansion to do, the tr to do those checks. Uh, let's head back. Alright, it does look like ads are about to start. I'm trying to think of where else I can go. We will let ads go ahead and play so you guys don't miss out on anything. We do run ads three minutes per hour to turn off free rolls and such. This is just a chance for me to take a break and you guys to take a break. If you don't want to see them, you know what to do. So we will be back. Great, I do believe ads are over, so thank you everyone for your patience. Yeah. Uh, I've got to think about where we need to go. I guess we could go check the outpost. There's just a lot of things we can't do because we haven't seen any hammer updates. I mean, we haven't seen any hammers, any boots, partners in a while, sadly. I can't do any of the panel checks. 
I don't even have enough star pieces to check with Marlo. Again, this is all... This is all still new, so... I mean, I'm, as an RPG, I was pretty familiar with. And then even then, the guide kind of had a, an, a vague idea of where to find... Easy. Where to find checks and stuff. Which I don't know if the randomizer or if anyone else out there has like a a guide that says, oh, here's where your checks are. Like we have points as to where the logic is, but as to where specific checks are, I'm not sure, sadly. an item. We have 17 points left. So we know where there's a possibility of at least one letter, and that's back in Shy Guy's toy box that the, the one Shy Guy had. to hurt and you're worth six star points Smash. Uh, not there. Huh. Whack a whack. Up Hmm. 
Ooh, item pouch. Okay. Like that. Again, I know once I get whichever boots and or hammer requires in order to flip those panels, I'm definitely going to have some backtracking to do. Heck, I was not expecting to find that out here. Hey, speaking of which... Woo! Something back here. And the dolly, wow. Okay, so that's a prologue check. Okay, and uh, this is cleared out. Nice. Anything else is just extras. All we'd have to do now is uh, get paracarry, but with that I have to get letters. But cool. I would like the flower saver badge, but... I don't really have the means for it, sadly. Ah! Uh, no, we're leaving. Where's this panel at? But we got the hammer. That was actually kind of a nice perk. Meh. for you, Paragary. At some point or another. Oh yeah, I can do this check now. Not that I think... Oh! I was about to say, not that there's gonna be anything valuable, but I was wrong. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Bow. He's now she can do more damage, and I can go open up those areas back in the sewers. There is that. Good trip, very worth. Again, was not imagining to find the hammer out here, but whatever.
Uh, yeah, that place. Where is this panel? No, I need the super boots. I need the super boots or the ultra hammer. No! Oh. That's what it was. Oh, well. Down the sewers, I guess. into equipping more badges, but you know what? Hmm. You know what? Have this. Coconut dispelled the electricity. Wow. Please don't let it be a pebble again. Hey. You take those. I can do. other partners do I have? I have 
a bow. Here. I picked up bow and what? I started with lackluster, which I still don't know where where I should put lackluster and like your boots and starter boots and hammer. Is it going Toad Town? I don't know. Yeah, I didn't do enough research before I started this. That goes under the star points icon. Oh. Whatever starting boots and hammer were. Yeah. Gotcha. We got the blooper and a buttload of experience! Let's go! And now we have access to prologue! <laughs> that, that, that. Perfect. There are mean settings exist where you're expected to find your starting gear. Oh no! Like, you can't, like, use them at all? Eh, sure. Eee, that that is mean. items I have to dodge enemies with, the better. Yep. Miracle water. And the question is, is it real? Hmm. Oh, you know, I think this was where one of the partner upgrades I actually missed was because I don't remember coming down here in my vanilla playthrough, oddly enough. Oddly enough. can get here at least. Koopa Village. You head out the good luck. Thanks for hanging out, Medley. Have a good one. A prologue. Here you are. Yeah, sure. Hmm. 
Thanks. He turned in the dolly. He hasn't really given us anything of importance. I am gonna take a nap though. We got a couple of things we gotta check. Alright, how mean is prologue? Wow. That's a lot of experience. Letter? Yes. Okay. Good. One more letter to, I guess, checking with Air Gary. Jump charge. No, yeah, it doesn't count. Ooh, are we gonna have to fight what's his face? Sushi? Sushi! Let's go! Alright, we have seven points here left to find. Of course. Gotta beat the kid. Ooh, you've got a lot of health.
think he has defense, so... Ow! You hurt. Ooh, that didn't last long. That was hers. to survive another round. Great, we should have this. That's a lot of experience. Oh, we're so close to another level up. Let's go. <laughs> oh. Save that. Not feel like dealing with him again. But we found sushi. Oh, you know what? I bet the panel is one of the other checks that's out here. If I can get this last bit of experience from this Goomba, we can go ahead and get that level up. Yes. Okay, things are hitting harder, so I kind of want to have more HP. <laughs> Oh wow, one badge point for an FP plus? That's nuts. Er. Thank you. 
Try that out. No, oh, Chuck Wismo. What? Oh, this is where uh, Goombaria found us, right? I didn't realize there was a star piece panel back there. checks. I'm betting one of those is going to be the panel. And I actually think there were two more panels, so that's probably it. If... There we go. Goombas actually aren't bad for experience. takes care of everything else. Okay, cool. Worth coming out this way. I'll take that. Well, whenever we can get to Tubba Bubble- Tubba Blubba's castle, we should be able to take him out. That's a lot of health. Lucky. Mm. 
Alright, one down. I'm not gonna be able to take him out with the next move. Can't risk it for the biscuit. I don't know what chapter scaling this is, but I just know this is a lot tougher than prologue or chapter one. Alright, we got him. So really, there's not going to be anything else over here other than opening up the way to Prologue. Alright, buddy, how tough you gonna be? swap over to bow she can do more damage pretty lucky <laughs> need to level up though. Mm, go BB. Go 
boy, Paper Mario Rando. Yeah! How are you, Fire Dude? Yeah, since we finished up our vanilla playthrough last week. Oh! Of course. Of course. Should have known that was fake. Doing pretty good today? That's good. Great nerds. Yep. Time to be blasting off again. Looks like you're pretty far into the seed. I've gotten some progress, but I haven't cleared any chapters yet, sadly. I'd like to make some progress. I might see if I can go maybe do Koopa Brothers? But then... I don't have Cooper yet. I don't know, it's weird. Yeah, first seed and all, so just learning checks, logic, all kinds of stuff. So like, we're definitely making some good finds, but nothing I feel that we can progress with yet. Getting all the stars are just a certain number. It should just be a certain number because this is um, a settings string that I believe Supreme and Spike Vegeta came up with where it's uh, four stars. Four stars are required. Uh, let me see. What was this? Dodge Master. Ooh. Ooh, I also want this. Does this have the updated thing where you go to Star Summit to see the ones you need? It does. It does indeed. So, funny enough, when we went up there, we saw that we had L Star, Mama, L Star, Mamar, Skullbar, and Muscular. Like, one through four. Not even joking. Mm. Sure. Those. Oh, wow. Well, it's worth it. Oh, and I guess we can't in. Well, no, because we need the pulse stone. We found some stuff. It's something, something so far, nothing very concrete. Like, we need a lot of items to get through, like, chapters two and three and such. A lot of high-cost badges in the seed, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> There's still so many checks in a uh, Toad Town. Checking the bad shop guy. I have been checking with Rolf. Probably should check with him again. Yeah. I forget if he's had anything good. I don't think he has. Oh, that's right. You can talk to him to swap out. Thank you. Uh. 
Hmm. So is this going to be like everything? Or do I have to clear certain chapters to make it? Because I haven't been able to clear like any chapters unfortunately yet. Okay. Hmm. Well, let's go down. Because we have a way to get to the dry, dry outpost. After we already beat the blooper. Only gets new stuff after each chapter cleared. Ah. That's what I was wondering. Welcome in, Stalking Geek. I hope you're well. Alright. Oh, back. Ooh. Nothing in here. Trying to learn all the stuff on your tracker to see what you have. Yeah. You have the means to reach Lava Lava Island yet? Um. I think technically I do, since I have what? And I can get the whale, I think? Oh yeah, there are a few checks at Lava Lava Island. Hmm. Oh yeah, we'll see the we'll see the dude. There we go. Oh and have a lemon. Room, dusty hammer. I forgot about that, but I had the lemon on me anyway. A goom nut? Really? Imagine if the Dusty Hammer got swapped out for something else in the rando. Oh, gosh. Uh. Dry Shroom Dusty Hammer. What ho? Cost him and drop sure always in there. Needing for Koopa's quest? Yeah. That sounds right. Interesting though that he has the strange leaf and the goon nut in here. But, you know, randomizers. Alright. <clears throat> Let's go meet Mustafa. See what he's got on him. Yeah, who all here has played this randomizer before? Ooh! <laughs> hey, that's close. And that was the only important thing here. Sweet. Cool. Ooh. Oh. Oh. That's gonna mean Mustafa doesn't have anything. Rip. Rip. You only watch Supreme from time to time when you can't sleep? Yeah! Supreme's a cool dude. I, rem I was actually inspired to try Paper Mario Randomizer for myself after watching him play it. It looked like a lot of fun. And I remember playing the OG Paper Mario like back in the day and then we recently refinished our replay of it. You have the desert map for this. Someone linking it in the Pi Discord. I 
don't know about the desert map. I mean, I understand where stuff is. It's like if we go south where the oasis is, we'll get the super block and then, uh, kinda how to get to the, uh, dry dry ruins. But then we're gonna need the pulse stone. Yeah. Oh. The calculator? I mean, it's not necessary, but interesting. Hmm. There's still a lot of stuff out in the desert, too. Oh, and we also bought the artifact, so we could go trade that to, uh, Colorado. Huh? Why is there glittering if it's not dropping anything, huh? Or is it this tree? There we go. Dizzy stomp. Not on the list. Go in Colorado. I'll blow you up. Your wife doesn't first. Oh, thank you, Fire Dude. I think you get sucked up by the twister. You get on top of a rock that has a check, if you remember correctly. Ooh. Okay. And thank you. I appreciate that. says where checks are. Oh, that's excellent. Hey, let me favorite that. Shoot. Okay, doesn't look like ads are starting soon, so we're gonna go ahead and take a quick break. I suggest you all do the same. <laughs> 